I'm going to do my best on this dinosaur's name coming up. A new species was found in Mongolia, and a new Mexican paleontologist is actually on the team studying this new find. The specimen was found as part of a construction project and specifically to put in a water pipeline in southern Mongolia. It was, if you will, an accidental discovery that people were paying attention while they were excavating and they excavated a block and said, hey, wait, something's in here. Now, what they found is called Dunicus tusogbatari. Hope I'm saying that right. Dr. Anthony Fiorio was on the international team researching the fossils. Now, despite its intimidating size, shape, and claws, Dernicus probably actually didn't do any hunting. The claw, the fingers have this claw that really almost curves around. And what that tells us is that Dernicus probably was raking in vegetation branches, if you will, to its mouth to eat, much like People are probably familiar with how a sloth eats. Now, researchers say that Duonicus weighed more than 500 pounds. They believe it roamed the Earth 90 million years ago, including here in New Mexico. So I'm wondering if it, you know, ate like a sloth. Did it also move? Was it just like a really slow-moving slow. dinosaur? I imagine that it probably would not have made it very far, you know, during the age of the dinosaurs. It would probably become lunch for a T-Rex. Uh, if it didn't, but uh, nonetheless, really fascinating and great that the, the excavators were able to say, wait a minute, this isn't just regular rock, that they were able to preserve that and find it. And now, much like the T-Rex, this new guy needs a nickname. Yes. What were we saying? I think Donnie. Or Duo, like duo. the owl. Duo. Okay, there you go. Like duo. Duo. I like that. I like that. Duo the dinosaur. <laughs> much easier than the other pronunciation. Yes. <laughs>